please remember to subscribe and share this video to help disabled animals with donated wheelchairs. This is the Humane Rat Trap from Trash 3.0. Let me show you how it works first and we'll decide, discuss how it was put together. We'll use this rock as Mr. Rat and he will just jump right in here and the trap is sealed. Now I check these traps at least twice a day so there's no uh, threat that there's going to be any damage from suffocation and also they're not in the sun so they're not going to bake or anything like that too. But let's uh, take a look at the anatomy of this trap. One, it starts off with a large container and this was a Costco uh, pretzel container so it was quite large and I tried to figure out what would be an easy way to make a lid slap down on top of it and hold in place. Well, experimenting around, it came up with using a foot plate attached by a pole to the top. So basically, as they try to push up through this, they're actually pressing down on the bottom part. So what connects the two? We use a uh, piece of irrigation piping that I had just like laying around, come in different lengths. Uh, I found the one that was approximate for this, Did do, didn't do any cutting at all, and then used uh, some plumbing parts. That came from when I replaced a, uh, a toilet fill valve, and, uh, and there's usually extra parts laying around. I think they're half inch gauge, so that was actually from trash also. The top is actually from a uh, I, I think an instant noodle or uh, vegetable type thing that I kind of kept to use for microwave and I held on to it. And the reason I use that, you just see there's a little bit of a slope on the sides there. Um, I wish there was more of one, but that uh, seems to be adequate on there. And the bottom is in place because this is just a uh, uh, pitted dates. And the reason why I use this is because I can bend it and then stick it through the top here and it folds back out. And it's about the same width as the bottom of this container here. So this works really well. And I have some video of uh, it. Now, uh, I have to warn you that the video was shot using a dash cam that has a whine to it. And the reason I was using a dash cam is it had automatic infrared lights on it and uh, I was finding out that motion detection from some of my other cameras wasn't picking things up as much as I'd like to. So this was a little bit more accurate. So I hope you enjoy that, pardon the wine, and hope you build a humane rat trap out of trash. Please remember to subscribe and share this video to help disabled animals with donated wheelchairs.